Yo, I'm Craig Benner, and me and my team just created the first synthetic bacteria in 15 years. For that, we mapped out the first human genome, my own. My goal was to change medicine's approach to being proactive, predictive, personalized, and preventative by using the whole genome sequencing and cutting edge imaging and measurement technology. Sequencing is truly a medical revolution. Despite what my critics say about my work, deciphering the human genome is revealing things about ourselves medically that we couldn't understand otherwise. My own genome showed an increased risk for prostate cancer. Oh no! I went on an exploration to find a bunch of new marine life genes called the Global Ocean Sampling Expedition. It was in ocean exploration genome project with the goal of assessing the genetic diversity in marine and microbial communities and to understand their role in nature's fundamental processes. It began as a sea pilot sampling project in August 2003. I announced the full expedition on March 4, 2004. The project used my personal yacht, the Sorcerer 2. It started in Halifax, Canada and circumnavigated the globe and returned to the U.S. in January of 2006. I have done a lot for the current field of science. I am currently the president of the J. Craig Venter Institute, which conducts research in synthetic biology. In June 2005, I co-founded Synthetic Genomics, a firm dedicated to using modified microorganisms to produce clean fuels and biochemicals. And in July 2009, guess what? ExxonMobil announced a $600 million collaboration with me to research and develop next generation biofuels. Yeah. Alright, I'm Craig Benner. <laughs> I have found 1,200 new species and 1.2 million new genes. Take a look. It took me three years collecting saltwater samples. That's some <laughs> shit. Okay. Well, Craig, that's some fine work you did. Thank you. You know, I was a surf bum wannabe when you know I left home at age 17 and moved to Southern California to try and make up, just take up surfing as a vocation. But um, this was in 1964, and there's this nasty little thing called the um, Vietnam War, and yeah, as a result, I got drafted. My critics really like to talk about the dangers of genetic engineering and messing with nature. Dare you modify genes? You're not supposed to what? Your genes. It's for science! Get it's for science! Stop! <laughs> Look guys, if we can't make something ourselves, how are we supposed to understand it? Who cares? Uh, no, no, hear me out. The medical advances are really good and stuff. You, sir, sure, should think about, like, look, like, look, look, yeah, yeah. it's really tons of medical uh -huh. advancements. You, you get lots Yo. of oh. genomes. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah.